And she yeah, said, list, list this. What's that, gentlemen? Hey, Reggie. Masterpiece of the Week is a segment we do every week in which we revisit some of the funny, stupid, or odd things that we've said over the last week. Um, I don't know where to start. So I will start with something that made me chuckle because it's just Mike decided to make a declarative statement. I'm a hockey guy. <laughs> We're the KNC masterpiece right here. I'm going to watch YouTube. <laughs> Uh, they watch YouTube. <laughs> you laughed over that part too. What what, what is the re uh, the relevance there, Mike, between those two statements? Because when I asked my Alex Ovechkin question, it was because I was watching some YouTube stuff on hockey, and these guys were having a pretty good debate on hockey cards, like sports cards, hockey cards, and uh, about possibly like going in on Ovechkin because there's a possibility a few years from now that he is the NHL all-time goals leader. He has a chance to pass Wayne Gretzky. And I didn't know that. I mean, I thought like Wayne Gretzky was kind of like Jerry Rice where no human being ever is going to break Jerry Rice's records and nobody's ever going to break Wayne Gretzky's records. It's one record, but kind of the one that's most important kind of to hockey, goal scored, that Ovechkin has a chance to become the all-time leader in NHL history. So I use that for a question to Marty Turco. Okay. I just I was surprised you thought people would make that jump there between those two statements. Thanks. Um, my best. Now, I am interested in getting your input also on this statement that you made. Wake up. I have the wake ups because I have men's tea <sighs> clinic inside of me. You Is that a new location? I don't understand. Wake up. I have the wake ups. Hmm. I wake up. It's the first of the month. I don't know. <laughs> Hold on. To throw did some you bone just thugs in there? Did you just do the first of the month from Bone Thugs and Harmony? Yeah, I did. To include wake ups. Mm -hmm. Tremendous. I did. That, how does that song start? Isn't it wake up, wake up? It's the first of the month, so cash your checks and get on. Is okay. it get on? That's, that's fine. I wanted you to do the skit, but that's that's uh, fine. Go ahead. That's how. That's how it starts. I think. So we're not going to talk about the fact that he said he had men tea, men's tea in him? <laughs> I do. <sighs> that's how it gets inside of you. Oh, my you shot. sweet Jesus. All right. That's true. It's, I don't know how but else to explain it. Man. Is it your men's tea or is it? I don't know. Uh, never mind. All right. Let's, where where need... does the shot go? What? Okay. Continuing can, on. I guess you can get it in your no, arm. I don't I'm know if just, you can ask. I'm, like, I'm can debating because I, I know this is going to haunt me. You know what the hell with it. She said it was okay if I mention it. I did give my wife a shot in the butt this morning. I am so proud For of you right now. medical purposes. Yeah, it was. <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> testosterone. She doesn't need that. This was <laughs> Kevin was bragging. Not is kissing, that what you were describing here, telling. Kevin? So I forcefully pushed it back into the desk. Okay. <laughs> I did it too hard. It bounced off of the desk and flipped over. <laughs> For the record. <sighs> no, that was about a chair. I get it. It is funny. But in the video, they do say force. Well, okay. <laughs> they say forcefully jab her with it. Because... <laughs> Or him, right? Like it could be. Yes, or I guess that it is, is true. In this instance, I was putting the well. Okay. The needle. I it's can't a needle. Have this conversation. You were sticking a needle into somebody. Yes, Say it not right, into dude. a guy. Stop saying it sexually. I'm sorry. This is not. It's not a sexual. I'm not entertained thing. by this. Let's let's get serious, guys. <laughs> oh, there's no more serious here. Um, Mike. Uh -oh. I, we got to give Mike some credit here. His segues have been getting pretty good. Oh, yeah. The unwritten rules are stupid, and the sport has gotten soft. And do you agree? <laughs> we'll talk about it next right here on The Fan. All right, let's talk about Men's Tea Clinic. Look, if you feel like you're too soft, Men's Tea Clinic can help. I thought that was freaking hilarious. I laughed harder then than I did just now, though. Mm -hmm, because mm -hmm. there was an element of surprise that I was like, wow, that was glorious. He Mike. is getting great at his transitions, isn't he? Thanks, man. Okay, well then, is there an element of surprise here, Corey, from what Mike says? You, yeah. You, you want Sue to say that, right? It would make you feel better, though. Yeah, yeah, but if you met a new person that's seeing you naked, that's probably bad for your life. I mean, not necessarily. Uh, I mean, you don't know why he's naked. Yeah, he yeah. goes to the YMCA. Yeah, there's times where I've showered naked. 
How often, Mike, a week, do you think you shower naked? Mm. What are you thinking about this? Every time! How do you know? Are you there? Yeah. It's... Sometimes I'm cold. <laughs> what do you have on if you're... Oh my god. A parka? Yeah, what are you wearing in the shower if you're not naked? I regret asking that question. I don't even want to look at Mike right now. I'm literally covering my face. I don't want to look at him. Take a shower with your underwear and see how it feels. I... Do you do that? That would be like taking a carpet shower, though, Mike. That's that would like, be... That's like how middle schoolers shower after, like, uh, PE because they're afraid of looking at each other. Or being seen. I shower naked all the time. Guys. Okay. Oh, it's right. just a joke. Good you know. Hear. Just goofing. Um, <laughs> Corey made a declarative statement that I think we all need to address right here, right now. Dak has to get re-injured. Oh, oh, no, Corey! Why? That job is already filled on this show of people who think that. Reggie? Yeah, I get it. Are, um, you, are you, like, putting out yeah, a Reggie. hit? I don't understand, Corey. What are you doing? Why I do you hate that? I can't remember exactly what Classic the purpose Corey. was for that but i think it was in order to like have a you know see the next quarterback kevin this kid that we were talking about oh that's what it was was it brady something that we were looking at uh it from didn't illinois sound like you're very sure of where it was the came it was from. the it was the illinois kid and you were like will he be the best quarterback from illinois and i yeah. was like if he gets his chance he would have to get injured and McCarthy mm -hmm. would say, I'm never letting ben Danucci play again. Okay, so you weren't roster. putting out a hit. You were no. trying to you're trying to drop the game plan for another quarterback to put out a hit on Dak Prescott. Isn't that what he did to Romo? Oh my lord. What? Don't start that. And Kellen Moore? No. And finally. Probably not. <laughs> Kevin, you know, gauging the limits of his ability. I could do three of those in an hour, no prop foot longs in an hour, no problem. <laughs> Do you think you, you could do five? Now we're... Man, there was a time when I could have. I feel like now, <laughs> probably not anymore. You just oh. beat me. Yeah, you won. You won so fast. Uh, like, I loved the desk thing earlier, Kevin, but you bragged so hard about that that you even said three, which is already a big number. Then you were like, hold on. I got to ensure that everybody understands this thing's a foot long for each of them. Like, you went back and corrected yourself to let people know. Nice work, man. I'm proud of you. I'm not proud of myself, and this is going to be bad, but I am going to vote for Mike's transition into uh, his men's tea clinic spot. Talk about it next right here on The Fan. All right, let's talk about men's tea clinic. Look, if you feel like you're too soft, men's tea clinic can help. That was good. Top notch. But not as good as what we just did with you about three and five. <laughs> I could do three of those in an hour, no prop foot longs in an hour, no problem. Do you think you could do five? Now we're man, there was a time when I could have. I feel like now probably not anymore. <sighs> I am a monster. We're really uh, skilled. Mm, I want to hear the desk thing again, but I know what my vote has to be, Kevin. And I guess I'm guessing then, Kevin. How do you feel about four? Because you were kind of curious, like uh, curious about five, but you felt pretty strongly Can't get to about five three. Until you do four. Yeah, that, I guess it's true. I, no. Would you no! consider? Would you consider four? No. I will three's, not. Three's your limit. What's your vote, Reggie? <laughs> oh, I just thought that this was hilarious. There's times where I've showered naked. <laughs> I'm gonna shower with my clothes on tonight. See how it goes. Yeah, let us we know do, it, do a video. Do a video and send it no, to Kevin. No, you can't do that. I do not want a video. It's a 1980s music television video. What? Did you forget oh, MTV? I just gave it its whole name. <laughs> We're the KNC masterpiece. Pour some sugar on me, cause I'm really wet. Pour <laughs> some sugar on me, cause I'm in the shower. Still got my clothes on. <laughs> but that goes. Nope. All of that, well, most of that is wrong.